Introducing the Transboard, a new generation of electric scooters from U.S. and South Korean company Mercane Wheels. The Transboard's die-cast aluminum alloy frame can support up to 220 pounds. The reliable 500-watt motor is powered by a removable battery system for easy charging. Attractively designed, superbly portable, and surprisingly fun to ride, the Transboard could easily become your favorite way to get around. Check out the Snicky Bike, a Canadian creation made for navigating the urban jungle. Though this amazing e-scooter failed to reach its Kickstarter goals, the Snicky Bike seemed like a great idea. This urban mini warrior combined a 16-inch motorized rear wheel with a full-size bicycle wheel up front for rolling over obstacles. With its short wheelbase, the Snicky Bike had the nimbleness it needed to navigate crowded city streets and sidewalks. For added visibility amid heavy traffic and throngs of pedestrians, the Snicky Bike was ridden in a standing position. Coincidentally, one two-hour charge of its removable 36-volt lithium battery provided approximately 32 kilometers of travel at 32 kilometers per hour. That's plenty of capability for the average commute or errand runner. As perfect as the Snicky Bike seemed, nothing has been heard from its creators for some time. Hopefully someday the Snicky Bike will be resurrected, or a similarly designed scooter will appear on the market. If you've never heard of gravity bikes, this wild creation from Sin Cycles will get you up to speed, literally. So, what's a gravity bike? A bike that runs exclusively downhill, of course, using nothing but the force of gravity and a really heavy lead ball for added weight. The Sin Cycles gravity bike achieved hair burning speeds of 50 to 80 miles per hour and beyond. With enough weight and a secure riding platform, speed is only limited by the downward grade of the road and the G-force acceleration provided by slinging around curves. While speed limits can sometimes be, uh, accidentally exceeded, gravity bikes are legal on any public road where bicycles are allowed. To create this roadrunner, Sin Cycles relied on the standards all gravity bikes must adhere to. The bike can weigh no more than 34 kilograms, wheel size limited to 51 centimeters, as is the maximum axle length. There is in fact an actual rule book governing gravity bikes, but they don't always apply depending on who's watching. What's rule number one? Try not to crash. This amazing scooter can actually drive itself. Check out the K01 electric scooter from US and UK company Kawano. The K01 trims down the traditional scooter by shedding an entire wheel, packing a powerful electric motor. This pogo stick shaped creation is controlled by leaning your body in the desired direction. Just step on, calibrate, launch, and go. Its spring type shock suspension system minimizes impact from bumps or uneven surfaces for a smooth, effortless ride. Should you decide you'd rather walk than ride, you don't even have to carry it. Just activate the follow me function through the wireless control app and the K01 will tag along with you anywhere. That's insane. With the LCD display, you can check your speed and battery level, calibrate your balance, and change ride modes. A GoPro camera can be mounted near the wheel for capturing your rides. The K01 also includes rider pegs, LED lights, and a kickstand. Customizable fenders and hand grips are available with an optional urban or sport tire. If you're ready for some real action, lean into the K01. You never know who you'll impress. Check out the Go2, one of the most portable urban electric scooters ever created. The GoTube's sleek, minimalist design truly breaks new ground in the growing electric scooter world. 
weighing only 12.8 pounds and extremely small in size. The GoTube unfolds and sets up in seconds. Maximum speed is 18 kilometers per hour, but a full 12 kilometer range can be achieved on a single charge when limiting your speed to 16 kilometers per hour. With the push button tachometer, you'll always be in total control of your speed. Even over obstacles or on inclines of up to 10 degrees, the dual wheel shock absorption provides a smooth, steady ride. Night mode engages the bright front LED for maximum visibility. When not in use, the Go Tube can be quickly folded into a compact form. It then fits within an attractive case with a convenient strap for super portability. The GoTube's USB charging port can save the day if you need a power source to back up your phone or tablet. With the many features the GoTube can boast about, remember, it's not called bragging when you can back it up. Introducing the iTank, an incredible three-wheeled electric street marauder from Chinese company Duhan. If you're looking for a powerful, fantastic...